Hi, welcome back. Today's project is putting on some Bark Busters on my R1200GS. Um, these videos are sponsored by Pacific Motorcycle Tour, so please come join packmototours.com. Um, if you like the video, I'd appreciate it if you'd uh, give us a thumbs up, or better yet, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Um, and uh, we're going to put on these Bark Busters today. So I've got the stock BMW uh, hand guards on here, and of course, they're just plastic. Uh, these bark busters have an aluminum bar inside that provides much more protection uh, for your hands. And then the covers I chose were the black on black. I'm not a very flashy guy, so I didn't want uh, a color or the bark buster in white on the black, so um, I just chose black on black. So, um, all right, let's go get to the project. Okay, we're going to start by removing the, uh, the BMW uh, hand guard, so there's a screw right here in front and there's a screw here. So this one in the front is a T25 screw, so I'm just going to use my screwdriver to get that one. And then here for the handlebar end, I've got a T50 Torx um, to take that one off. That was not very tight, so we will solve that problem when I put the new ones on. Okay, so here is the assembly. You can see that here for the right side, it, it angles a little bit towards the left. So that's the, the proper one. Uh, I have a bolt, I have a spacer which came with the kit, and then I'm using the original uh, spacer piece here that came uh, with the bike. So I am just going to lightly position things here to get it started so I can see what it's going to look like. Um, there's the old original bracket uh, from the original one. So I'm just going to hand tighten this a little bit. And it looks like I'm probably going to have to loosen up um, the uh, assembly over here so I can get the, uh, the bolt in from the back side. So we will, we will check that out. Okay, so we've uh, just lightly attached this here. Uh, this is the bracket that I need to, need to put on this back side. And yeah, it is not gonna fit on here without me uh, loosening or removing these two screws so I can get this, uh, this bracket in on the back side of the handlebar. Okay, so I have a T30 Torx. I'm just loosen these up here. I'm gonna see if I can do it without taking it all the way off. I think I can. Yes, I can. Okay, let me go get the screws. Okay, I have two screws. Uh, there's a 20 millimeter screw and a 30 millimeter screw. The 20 millimeter screw uh, goes on the top, the 30 goes on the bottom. Uh, all of the Barkbuster pieces are uh, hex, so this is uh, uh, a four millimeter hex. I guess the Australians like uh, everything in hex. So I'm just going to start by uh, just getting these positioned in here first. All right, I'm going to re-tighten the uh, brake assembly here, just lightly hand tightened, okay, so I can adjust everything in a bit. This is just hand tightened here as well. Okay, we have the, uh, the support bar arm, it's horizontal to the ground. We're gonna tighten the, uh, the bar end bolt first, then here, then this and this. So this one is a six millimeter hex, we're gonna set that to, uh, to 21 Newton meters and give it a little tighten here. All right. Okay, this nut right here is a five millimeter hex. It gets uh, tightened to 20 Newton meters. So let me get that adjustment here. There's 20, okay. All 
Perfect. Okay, and uh, these two are a four millimeter hex and they get tightened to 10 Newton meters. Okay, they're all tightened. My final piece before I put on the cover is just to make sure I have the, uh, the levers right where I want them, and I think I do. So give it a little twist there before I tighten it down. It feels just right to me. Okay, I have my, uh, my levers positioned where I want them. These are uh, T30, and I am going to tighten them to eight Newton meters. So it's just slightly more than hand tight. Okay. Okay, the final step is putting on our uh, plastic guard. You can see we have a little pilot hole right here, a pilot hole right there. There's these screw holes here and it comes with the screws that screw into the aluminum. So this snaps on here. I put these two screws in and uh, we'll be done with the right side. Okay, we've got uh, the Bark Busters installed on, on both sides. Uh, as you can see, it's an easy project. Remove the old ones, put the new ones on, uh, torque everything down as, as required, and uh, you're ready to go out and have some fun. So uh, again, thanks for joining. These videos are sponsored by Pacific Motorcycle Tours. So please come join us at packmototours.com. Uh, if you like the video, give, a, give us a thumbs up. And even better yet, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. So thank you very much, and we'll see you next time. Have fun riding.